Yo, what's up guys, it's Suraj from Tech Devoted and welcome back to one of the best Android apps episode. This time around we've got 10 apps and I'm doing this in collaboration with my friend Saga from Techworks. Feel free to check him out if you like what you see. And as always, all download links are in the description but without wasting any more time, let's jump right into the video. Commencing this list is Juke. This is a genius app or rather revolutionary I should say. Remember when you're in a party and your friends constantly plug in and plug out aux cables between different phones to play the song of their choice? Yeah, it's super annoying. This app solves that. Once you install and open up Juke on your phone, when somebody sends you a text message with the word song space their song's name, the app will add the song to the queue and play one song after another. For example, song Lose Yourself would play Lose Yourself by Eminem. And then if you send another text, say song Shape of You, it would play Shape of You by Ed Sheeran right after Lose Yourself is finished playing. Only downside here is that you have to send a regular text message and two, the free app only lets you play 100 songs. But fret not, I've got about 15 promo codes to the full version. Bang, 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 bang. I'll leave some in the description as well. And if you're following me on Twitter, just tweet at me, Suraj, give me the code and I'll give you one. Links in the description. Next app is Get Current Wallpaper. There have been so many occasions where I've seen a wallpaper on my friend's phone or have a wallpaper applied on my phone, but we don't have the actual wallpaper in the gallery to share it with someone. Get Current Wallpaper does exactly what the name says. It retrieves the current wallpaper on your smartphone and saves it to the gallery. There is not much else to the app. It just has one job and it does it pretty well. Up next is Blinkist and huge shout out to them for sponsoring today's video. Blinkist is a digital learning app that summarizes the main points of the world's best selling non-fiction books into 15 minutes experiences. I love the fact that you can read it on your own or have the app read it out to you at 1x, 1.25x, 1.5x or even 2x speed. So even if you're driving or running an errand, you can listen to the Blink just like a regular podcast or audiobook. When you first sign up, the app asks you to pick your interests so the expert team at Blinkist can handpick what's called a Blink based on your likes. The Blinks are extremely well written and quite easy to understand. Now while downloading the app and signing up is free, to fully enjoy Blinkist, you could choose to subscribe to a yearly plan which starts at just $5 a month. Then we have After Focus. This app helps you add DSLR like blur effects to your photos. You can choose which part of the image should be in focus and which part should be blurred out. You can even apply basic filters to your images from within this app. You can turn a normal looking shot into a great looking one with this app. Now you don't have to purchase the iPhone 7 Plus or the OnePlus 5 to take portrait images. You can get the desired results with this app as well. Next up is Vaporware Wallpapers. This wallpaper app has quite a unique vibe to it. It's not trying to be a wallpaper app with minimal pictures. It's got completely different walls such as anime wallpapers, VHS wallpapers, glitch wallpapers, etc, etc. There's over a thousand of them and they're all HD or higher in resolution. And then of course, if you like a wallpaper, you can directly set it as a wallpaper or save it to your gallery. Definitely not for everybody, but if you're into stuff like anime, you're gonna like this one. The next app is only for someone who is using or plans to get the Samsung Galaxy S8 or the S8 Plus. It is called BX Actions. This app helps you fix the most annoying thing about the S8. It allows you to remap the Bixby button to any action or app of your choice. You can even use this button to launch Google Assistant if you want. You can use Bixby Shutter to take pictures using this button. Or you can even disable the Bixby button completely with this app. Following that is what I think is yet another revolutionary app. Going by the name Stealth Audio Player, what it allows you to do is play audio through your phone's earpiece. Now we are all used to listening to audio from headphones or from the phone speaker directly, but what if there could be a third way? A third way for when you want to listen to something with privacy, but you don't have your earphones. Well, this app is exactly for that. Imagine you're in a noisy environment and you want to listen to that daily podcast, but you don't have your earphones and you don't want to use the loudspeaker and disturb others, well, use Stealth Audio Player. Open the app up and play any audio or video you like and you'll start hearing the audio from the phone's earpiece. The volume is adequately loud while still not causing disturbance. That is simply amazing. Next up, we have a game called Swing. It's a simple game where you swing the rope and try to land on a platform. Simply tap the screen and let go when the rope is long enough to reach the next platform. You can collect gems to unlock new characters. It is a simple and fun game which will test your precision and patience levels. If you are into simple and fun games, definitely give this one a try. 
Now drawing minus 2 a close is Origami Zupa. Well, you guessed it, it's a Zupa widget pack. And yes, the widgets have an origami design. That aside, there's not much I can say here. They look cool to me and there are over a hundred of them. There's something for every kind of wallpaper. If you are someone who is always on a lookout for discounted apps, you should definitely check out App Sales. Many of the paid apps are discounted or even available for free for a short time. Now that would be the best time to get those apps. This app keeps a track of most of those apps from the Google Play Store. You can see the description and price history of every app. If you are looking for a particular one, you can put it in your wish list and get notified once it is discounted or goes completely free. It is also a great place to discover new apps. Just hit the download button and start taking complete advantage of this app. But that about wraps it up for this video guys. Saga and I have made another list of amazing apps and the video for that is up on his channel. The link to that video is in the description so if you're interested feel free to check it out. It's been Suraj. Thanks so much for watching. Take it easy and stay devoted.